comes, here comes, here comes. Oh my god, he's right on there. Still there? Got him. There you go. <gasps> there we go. Nice walleye. Nice walleye. Keep going. Keep going. Oh, oh my gosh, go. yes. Woo! What's going on, everybody? Welcome back to NB Edits. Today, Nick and I are down here in the De Pere area out on the Fox River and we are fishing for some walleyes through the ice. We are not that far away from spring fishing, to be honest with you. But we're in the shack today because it's ungodly windy. Like, it is so windy outside. It's a disaster outside. If we walked out there, one, we'd probably get blown away, and two, <laughs> you wouldn't be able to hear anything we're saying, so. No, it was a hike to get back where we are, but we're on a really good spot, and we're hoping to get into some walleyes today. We've got our good buddy, Cody S. with us. Cody Solberg's fishing. He's in his shack with his friend. About five, ten feet away over yeah, there. He's right yeah. next to us. And sure, we're we'll be... show you guys, you know, once he hooks up or I'm whatever, sure he's we'll go right over away. there and show you. But so the one down for today, we're jigging. We're not using tip ups like you guys normally see on our channel, but we're jigging. This is the Fox River rods. We're both running Fox River rods while fishing the Fox River. So if you guys want to check out Fox River rods, uh, we'll leave a link down in the description. We're gonna go ahead and uh, basically all we're running is just jigging wraps. We're tipping them with minnow heads. We are out here fishing in- uh, I thought I had it marked on there. Oh, oh. We're in 12 feet. Yep, 12 feet of water today, at least as of right now, right where we're fishing here. Oh yeah, I just got a mark on screen. All right, it's not going to be long. Somebody's going to hook up. Oh, come on. That's a, that's a nice fish. There you go. Oh, look at him. Fish? I got the first one of the day, guys. <laughs> oh yeah. Perfect eater. That's probably a 19, 20 inch fish maybe. Came up off the bottom and just smoked the bait too. I mean, look at that. Look at where that bait is. Gone. <laughs> oh my goodness. He came straight up off the bottom and just inhaled it. Oh Let's my go, gosh. Let's go, Cody. Give me some. We are some out help. on Woo! the Fox River today. Uh, this, this, where we're sitting right now, was literally open two days ago. I mean, I'm not proud of what we did this morning, but it took us about an hour just to get out here. We sputted our way out and uh, got to the spot. We found some fish. And here we go, 10 minutes in, we got the first one on the ice. So hopefully That's it's a awesome. good day. It's it's about midday right now. I mean, it, you kind of figure we're gonna have like a midday lull and she's gonna start to pick up around, you know, three, three or four o'clock, but who knows, maybe we'll catch fish all day long. There's nobody else out on this spot right now. So we're just gonna have some fun and catch some fish today. Hopefully hook into something over 27 because last year I caught a 27 and three quarter in this spot and uh, I definitely want to try and break that. So. 29s, 30s, come on. We're dude. not even set up yet we and you already got it. a fish. I know. I'm gonna take this one home, I think. I think I'm gonna I'm gonna eat a fish tonight. Why not, huh? Hey, why not? It's alright to do it once every 10 years, right? Yeah, right. Alright. Nice job, Cody. Off to a good start. How are we looking? Any got marks any down marks there? No? Ooh, that's alright. Okay, that's exciting. Hey, we've been out here for like uh, five minutes so far, and Cody already freaking hooked up. One on nice the board, one. baby. Nice eater. Just what? had an air bubble. I thought there was a fish just screaming up. I like, just picked up my rod. You got some serious air bubbles going on down there. All oh, right. Well. Is that one? Oh my gosh! Stop, dude. There's so many <laughs> air bubbles that are screaming up right now. It's insane. Yeah. Hopefully, it's our turn soon. I would hope. Yeah. Hopefully. I mean, it's only been five minutes, and we are walleye fishing, so you know you could. Uh, you can go an hour without a fish, or you could have five in 30 minutes. So you just never know. How's it going? Just dandy. I have to set that right here. You can't see me, but I'm right here. You should find me a new candle. Oh, I love candles. Find I probably have one in the in our closet that I didn't use yet. You can have. I need a new one. You can have Heritage Pumpkin. There's a Shore Breeze. I like that. Sheer Linen. Wait, whoa, 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 whoa. Here we Wait, go. Kevin. Here we go. Here we go. Come on. Come on. Come on. Come on. Get them up. Get them up. Oh, here oh, comes. Here yeah. comes. Here comes. Oh my God, he's right on here. No. Come on. Still there. Got him. There you go. <gasps> yep. There we go. Fish on. Let's go. He's alright. Hey, that is not a fish. 
Nice walleye. Nice walleye. Nice walleye. Keep going. Keep going. He's close. He's so close. Oh, oh my gosh. Wow. Yes. Ooh. Let's go. Let's go. go. Hey, Holy buddy. There you go, dude. You like that? <laughs> Look at the belly on that one. That's a fat one. That's a tanker. Wow. I like just engulfed it too. That's the thing. Holy smokes. I'm having Caitlin too. You want to <laughs> film with that? Yeah. Caitlin? Where is she? Right here. Don't lose her down the hole. <laughs> Hi, Caitlin. Hi, <laughs> You're the good luck charm, huh? I guess so. <laughs> All right, guys, something you don't see too often. Brandon and I both in frame of a video. Usually we were filming each other. But this fish, gorgeous. First one all year on the Fox River, but it's through the ice. Really, really awesome. Haven't done a whole lot of jigging for walleyes, but that, that is a blast. I don't know why a tip-up fish, actually, when you can do stuff like this. <laughs> and it was only like an hour drive. It's not even far. This fish was 26 inches, though. Don't really have a weight on it, but I would imagine it's got to be. What do you think? That's pretty hefty, probably five and a half. It's six for pounds. sure over five pounds. Yeah, but for sure over five. Probably beautiful pushes. fish. Hasn't been out too long. Wasn't hooked too badly. Gonna get a release on it. Yeah, yeah, we had a bit of a lull for a while since Cody's fish. Woo! There it goes. Had a bit of a lull since Cody's fish. Maybe a solid hour of just marking fish in and out, and then that one, that one happened to hit. So. Cody did predict that it's supposed to get better here around 2, 3. I think, I don't know what time it actually is. It's got to be somewhere around 2, though, I would think. Yeah. So hopefully that's the first of many. Hopefully that's one of the smaller ones, too. You want to show them what you were using real quick? I am using number 5 Jig and Wrap Rapala. This is, what is this, clown? Is that actually the color of this? I believe so. And I swapped out the hook on the bottom to a red Gamagatsu. Not sure on the size, but... I don't, I don't know. Just a little flavor. I like using red hook, so I replaced it. But just stop that with a minnow, and you're good to yeah, go. Yeah, minnow head on the on the bottom trouble. And pound it on the bottom, and yeah, that fish came in and smoked it. So good test for the old Fox River rod. Yeah, the Fox River rod held up too. Nice. I like that. All right, let's get another one, boys. Let's do this. Okay. Well, that was exciting. All right. Now do we have Papa Squad. And let's get another one. That was a, that was hectic. That was a little crazy. Yeah, just Caitlin. FaceTime me. If you guys don't know, I am engaged. And Caitlin's been on the channel a couple times. She's not a huge fan of walleye fishing. That's why you probably never really see her walleye fishing. KB Bass Man. She did she did go once this year for the first time and dad mixed feelings. It was about cold. It. Caught a nice fish, caught a nice walleye. If you guys haven't seen that video, I'll leave in the description or pop it up somewhere in the video, I don't know. But yeah, she's more of a summer and spring type of fisherman. <laughs> Likes to uh, be out when it's warm. She's not one to be sitting out here, which is fine. The way she goes, but she was a good luck charm there. She got that fish to come in for me or whatever Definitely. happened. I don't know. I was distracted and saw the mark come on, and then I told her to shut up pretty much so I could catch <laughs> the fish. Oh my God, dude, that is enormous. Is that one fish? If that's one fish, dude. I gotta send this down. There's no way. Oh my gosh. Okay, we were packing things up. Things just got real crazy, real quick. Cody was just kind of messing around. No, 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 no. Oh, oh, wait. Don't scare him. Oh, that's an air bubble. Holy oh. Christ. Oh. oh, what the hell? <laughs> dude, that was an enormous The old left-hander trick. The old left-hander trick. Is that a sturge? No, that, that was probably a walleye. Probably a 13-pound walleye, really. Oh, oh my gosh, dude. Oh, that oh, mark was gigantic. <laughs> like, I can't even put that into words, guys. Wow. So you're telling me that we have to leave now after that. <laughs> what are we doing now? We're leaving. We're going to A&W. Oh, boy. Saucy. Oh, there it is. Let's Saucy. A&W. A-W. A-dubs. A-W. There it is. Holy curb, Cody. Oh, no, sorry. My Calm bad. Calm down. I know you want the food. <laughs> Do it. I'm so oh, excited. yeah. I Look at this. Get a load of this guy. Fill up that gas. Long. Brandon, what are you having? Hey, there's so many options. Check out the locals. Two for five surf and turf. Not a chance. Family box meal. We can do that since we're one big happy family. Absolutely. Good. All right. Oh boy. There it 
this is looking pretty fire right now. I haven't eaten for a bad day of fishing, huh? Yeah, I mean, it wasn't a bad day of fishing. It's just that it took forever and haven't eaten all day long. So, it's gonna be good. Oh my God, freaking stuff, dude. That was intense. But hey, it's time to go home. Cody, take us home. Thanks for taking us fishing, buddy. Hopefully you guys enjoyed today. It was kind of, kind of crazy. It was like, I don't know what to think of it. There were some really like high pressure moments, like just because the day started out so bold. I mean, we got there and within 10 minutes, yeah. you already had into a fish, you we know? We thought then, we were on them. Yeah, and then we went into a lull and then uh, you hooked up with that big one and that was like breathtaking. That was awesome because we don't get to do that a ton. I mean, obviously we've caught them on jig rods before, but I don't know, this year's just been a crazy winter for us and all we've been able to do is basically just tip up fish. So to get down here and hang out with Cody and hit the hard water and just start ripping some lips, it was fun. And I was really hoping that we were gonna get into some more. It was just so nerve wracking. Every single time you'd see a mark come up onto the screen and it's like, Jesus, is this one gonna bite? Again, hopefully you guys enjoyed. Uh, if you did, make sure to leave a thumbs up on the video. If you guys would leave a like, we'd greatly appreciate it. If anybody's new to the channel, make sure to subscribe. We're gonna be doing a lot more fishing down here in the De Pere, Wisconsin area with Cody. Uh, we've got a Swamp Donkey tournament coming up soon. March 28th. The, yeah, March 28th. The ice is actually going to hopefully be gone within like two weeks. I don't know. It's tough. It kind of depends on what the weather does, to be honest with you guys. But uh, I have a feeling we're walking on anywhere from two to six inches, and there's a good chance all of that's going to be gone in two weeks. So that's what I'm hoping for. So that way we can get down here and do a little pre fishing, open water. I know Nick's just dying to get onto the old open water. <laughs> I think we I all are. I know. We all are dying to get onto so, the open water. So. Yeah. Alrighty, guys. Well, again, thanks for tuning in. Hope you guys enjoyed that monster fish that Nick was able to pull out today. Again, if you guys enjoyed, leave a like. Don't forget to subscribe before you go. And until next time, tight lines from NBX. <laughs>